Hi and welcome back to another AutoWave video. In today's video we've got a 2008 Vauxhall Safira B and we're going to program a spare key using the Xtool Pad Elite available from AutoWave. This is the EU version as well so it's got added menus and a bigger vehicle coverage. For this video we're going to use our AutoWave key which is the AUT RK0006. I've already cut the blade, so it's ready to go. All we need to do is program it. So, first thing we need to do is plug it into the vehicle. So, the plug on the Safira B is just down here, below the gear stick in front of the handbrake. You just remove the cover and plug it in. So, first thing we're gonna do is, we're gonna go to Diagnosis. I'm gonna go to my Immobilizer menu, which is along the top there, as you can see. I'm gonna have a look at my menus, and I can see I've got my Opal Vauxhall EU menu. So I'm going to select that, I'll just agree to my disclaimer, and we'll let it load up. So, first thing I need to do is get my PIN code. So, I'm going to go to Read Security Code. It's given me now, what, seven options. I'm not sure which option to pick, so what I'll do, let's just try them one by one and see what happens. So, type one. Fail to connect. What I will do as well though, I'm going to put the ignition on just to, in case it needs ignition on for any of these procedures. So, ignition's on. So let's just try again. So, fail to connect. So we'll try type two. So switch ignition on, where it's on, press okay. This is doing no damage to the vehicle, it's just literally trying the right protocol for the car. So, wouldn't connect on that one. So I'll try the next one. Let's just see if it connects to this one. No, so we'll try type 4, read pin code, no, so let's try the next one, so display, so I've got a real feeling this will be like the Astra H where it reads it from the radio, so we'll turn the radio on, we'll press OK, yeah, and it's read it from the radio, so that's fine, so my pin number is 7433, I'm just going to take a quick photo on my phone, just so I've got it, OK, so I'll now press OK. So now I'm just going to go back. So I'll go back to my immobilizer menu. So select from vehicle, select from type. So let's try from vehicle. So this is a Safira B. So let's go down, Safira B. Program keys, erase all keys, number of keys. Well, let's just do number of keys. So current number of keys is two. So we know it's talking to the vehicle at this point. So now we can go to program keys. Please enter security code. So my security code is what well, I just got off the screen, which was 7433. So 7433. Done. Insert a new key to ignition to on. So I've removed my customer's original key. I'll place it on there. I'll get my new auto wave key. Insert it into the ignition and turn it on. Press OK. Remove the key. So I've turned it off, removing it. Press OK. Switch ignition to on. So I'm doing it on again with the new key. Successfully programmed. Whether to program another key. Well, I don't want to program another key, so I'm just going to press yes. I mean, no, sorry. So now, if I do number of keys, I should see three. So yes, current number of keys, three. Okay. So let's just go back. Let's just remove the key from the ignition. Let's just try the central lock-in. So vehicle locks, vehicle unlocks. So now we'll pull it in the ignition and we'll see if the vehicle starts. And vehicle starts. So basically, that key is now programmed to the vehicle, just following them easy steps with the X-Tool X100 Pad Elite. Um, thanks for watching the video. If you've got any questions, please drop a comment below and I'll get back to you and answer them for you. Thanks for watching, see you next time.